Our next guest is one of several pit bulls we have on the adoption floor right now. Um, she is uh, Belia or Belia, however you want to say that. Whichever way makes you happy, you can say it that way. Um, she will probably answer to either. Um, she is one, um, technically listed as one of our seniors, although she's not really acting like it right now. She's about six years old. She's black and white. Um, she was previously owned, and she came to us um, when the owner said that they have no home of their own, so they obviously are not capable of housing her um, as well. Um, she has previously um, done well with cats as well as dogs, although she wasn't currently living with one. She's been around children um, a five and up. Um, her previous owners did a great job filling out the profile, saying that she's playful, energetic, um, she rides well in the car, walks well on leash, she's used to vet checks, she's a chaser, a roamer, wanderer, so basically she's a dog. Um, that she, they say that she is both a house trained and crate trained. Um, one of the things that they said was that she loves to play with other animals. She um, loves to walk and sleep in a bed with covers and a pillow. So she thinks she's a person and uh, she will definitely, um, if you're looking for somebody to be a little spoon as you take a nice afternoon nap, she might be a great fit for you. But one of the other things that they noted, um, which is important for us, is that um, she has bad joints and it's hard for her to jump up on things. And um, just moments ago, we had her seen by another one of our vets. And um, so she does have an issue with her left hind leg. Um, it's possible and likely that sometime in the future she will need a surgery on that area. So um, for her right now, um, we're just recommending lots of rest. Um, when she goes out on a walk, she always needs to be on a leash so she can't be um, running around, potentially injuring herself. And we've had that with other dogs before um, with um, our American Bulldog mix, Angel. That was one of her things. She had some issues with her back legs as well. So keeping her on the leash um, really limits her ability to do anything that's going to be too taxing on, on that injured leg. Um, our other behavior assessment um, says that yes, she does indeed keep her kennel clean, although you always want to do a little bit of reworking with that house training thing in a new home. She's friendly, she reacts favorably to other dogs, she's a little bouncy and excited, which can, uh, she's strong, um, which can make her a little difficult to walk, so a harness would be great for her. No issues with food aggression, um, she reluctantly gives up objects when she's asked for them, and as you can see, she loves to be petted. So um, she's going to be a great uh, companion for some family, however, you just need to make sure that you can financially handle um, her medical care as she continues um, to age and just get that, that uh, left leg looked at, um, taking good care of that. If you're interested in her, you can visit her here at Animal Control. Our visiting hours for the kennels are going to be Monday, Tuesday, and Friday from 10 to 5, Wednesday and Thursday from 12 to 8, and Saturday from 10 to 4.